and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Mike Tyson. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, so here he is, Iron Mike Tyson. The flurry is coming. Look for him to use that signature peekaboo style to try to get inside. Has been vulnerable to leg kicks, though, since he transitioned to mixed martial arts. He's worked hard on the takedown defense. We'll see if Tyson can keep this fight upright here tonight in what is a very interesting stylistic challenge. Tyson gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Nice combination. Oh, the head kick lands. Counters with a right hand. Both fighters throwing heat now. Unable to connect with a right hook. Fast pace here in the early going. Just misses with the straight right. Lands the inside leg kick there. Great block there. Just misses with that one. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. There by Tyson. Oh, and there's that inside leg kick. And just slap yourself hard on the inside of your leg and tell me how that feels. I mean, it really hurts because that's the soft right. part of your leg. So you land that over and over again. Guy will have a very tough time maneuvering out of a lot of the techniques you throw at him. Well, he's got the accuracy to land right there. His opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Solid kick lands here. Straight right hand now, just misses. Nice. Oh, he is stunned. Drunk driving out there. We'll see if he can recover. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Big knee to the body. Just over two minutes, round one. Misses with the left hook. Under two minutes to go in a back and forth first round here. to Kembe Matumbo, but he is blocking all these shots coming Man, this way. get that out of here. He sees it coming. You're going to have to mix it up. Shake that finger. Shake that finger. Nice hook. Now some separation from his clinch position. Nice punch there by Tyson. He's got great kicks also. He needs to be throwing more kicks in this fight. He hasn't thrown uh, many at all. Perfect execution on that team. Closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Nice straight right hand. Under a minute now to go. Able to block that one. Huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Bone on bone, nicely done with the high kick. Oh, well timed and placed overhand by Tyson. Keep your distance, keep your distance now. 
Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Look at the control of the posture as that big knee lands. Gets to the single collar time. Look for him to keep that elbow tight and throw punches with his free hand. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. Great job out there. The boxing looks amazing. Let's keep up the pace, keep up the pressure. He's a piece of meat out there and just waiting to be knocked down. All right, so a lot of highlights over those previous five minutes. DC, take us through the replay if you will. A lot of good action, but punching led the dance. Punching was the thing that stood out to me. That allowed him to take control of the round. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. All right, so as this next round gets underway, hopefully the good action we saw in the last round will continue. Both fighters certainly had their ups and downs, both got the offense going, but now we'll see if one fighter or the other can really take control of what has been a very close fight thus far. Oh, he lands another debilitating... Oh! Oh, my God, it's hurt. It's hurt. Oh, good knee. Unable to connect there. Kick. Oh, big left hook there. Oh, nice body shot. He got him again with the kick. That was beautiful. Shots exchanged in the pocket there. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Big power shot there. Oh, that is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh! The jab followed by the right hand. Just out of range with that left hook. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Just over three minutes to go now. Oh, you heard him bad. Oh, a big left hand. Still plenty of time to go here, round two. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ following a game plan, and it's working. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh, Superman punch! Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. Pretty strong jab there by Tyson. Well, from a striking standpoint, he has put it all together tonight. He has landed a ton of significant strikes in. Pretty easy fight, I would think, for the judges to score. It's a pretty easy fight to score. Tonight was a night where everything went right, and that doesn't happen very often. Under two minutes here to go in round two. Is that a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Tyson gets caught by the straight punch. Punch got blocked there. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Just misses with a left hook there. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Great punch. Keeping busy now, connecting with those punches. Oh! He's got him hurt here. Oh! 
Nice job by him defensively there. Straight punch. Tyson gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. It looks like the cut man to my right is starting to get anxious with all the high volume of strikes being landed here. He has really kept his opponent on his heels throughout. He's had him on his heels. He's got him reacting. He's reacting to the feints. He's reacting to the jab. He's reacting to every single thing coming in his direction. He has got to find a way to change the narrative, to change the way that this fight is playing out if he wants an opportunity. But to this point, this boxer has looked amazing. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, five minutes. Well, what a round it was, especially from a striking standpoint. DC, take us through. High-level striking. I mean, this is what people come through the doors to see. Two men stand on a quarter, chest to chest, forehead to forehead, and let it all fly. I'm surprised nobody went out, but it does excite me for the next round. You ready? You ready? The crowd fired up, so are we third and final round. All right, pretty good back and forth action in the previous two rounds. Your expectations here as this next round gets underway. I expect the action to really pick up now. These guys have to lay it on the line as we start to approach the end of the fight. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. He went high on that one. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Landed that one. Missed on the right hand. Looks like someone took a red sharpie to his side. A lot of bruising courtesy of those body strikes. Well, big kicks, big punches. He's doing everything he told us he intended to do to slow this guy down. And you can see his opponent starting to really be labored in most of his movements. Oh, nice. Oh, misses with the jab. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. His opponent's got him in the clinch. He needs to break away and get back to his range because he's taking punch after punch from his clinch position. He is cut above the eye here. Three minutes now to go in this one. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's going to get his hand raised tonight. He's got to go forward. He's got to just throw everything at his opponent to try and find that punch or that kick that's going to end the fight. There is no time for strategy. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of Stunned, trying to recover here. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really starting to put it all together now. It clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. Good body work with that hook by Tyson. Moving to his left now. Nice jab. Two minutes now to go in the fight. Leg kick lands. Oh, strong hook to the head there by Tyson. Oh! Big right hand. Oh, big knee to the body. In the tie clinch, look for the knees to start. 
Tyson gets tattooed by that straight punch. Nice defense there, huge block. Left hook to the head. Oh, he's got the single collar locked in the clinch now. Going back. His opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up. But you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Under a minute now to go in the fight. Oh, big right hand, yes. Oh, nice hooks. All right, well, that blow is fauceting from that cut. Oh, you got to start to look to finish him now. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Continuing to work the body here. So the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking game. Yeah, he did a great job of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance, and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. The official decision is in. Bruce Buffer has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 30-27. Declared the winner by unanimous decision, Iron Mike Tyson! So, big UFC win for Iron Mike Tyson here tonight. Words you probably thought you'd never hear, but since crossing over from boxing, it has been all systems go for the former boxing